All right, guys, welcome back to more Far Cry 6. So we're back uh, to to that little town. We're going to talk to uh, Yelena about our next step in fighting. Um, talk to Yelena about your next steps. Yep, so I was right. So I don't know what's going to go down. Um, but the last video, she seemed... Uh, things seemed intense. You're free, my dudes. Help! Help! What do you mean, help? I freed you people. We want freedom. I freed. I Thank God. It's over. Down with Anton. I don't understand. All right, here we go. Oh wait, doors open. Nice work with that rescue. I heard you kicked Benitez's ass, Danny. I wish I could have been there, but my battlefield is right here, watching this goddamn door. <laughs> Why you run over there, bro? I think I want out of this shit. I heard it was someone okay. from Libertad that rescued our people. I want to see something real quick. Um, for my second weapon, I want to see if I can put a. No, I can't modify it. I can't put anything on it. God damn it. Let's put this. Uh, I wish I could put a suppressor on really? it. I would, that would be really cool. What's happening? Meeting on the mound. Some of our friends want to quit early. Okay, listen up. This isn't worth killing for. Sure as hell isn't worth dying for. We're young. We should be out there drinking and fucking and skipping school. Woo! Our parents and grandparents already stole our future. Why should we give a shit? That's what I used to think. And then one day, Admiral Benitez walked into my classroom with a gun. She called on your name, you came to the front. One by one. Alvarez. Bermudez. Carrillo. The Admiral read their crimes. Protesting, handing out pamphlets, liking a Clara Garcia post. Fernandez, Jimenez, Peña. I learned a lesson on my last day at school. You can either be on the right side of history or the wrong side of Castillo's guns. Wise words, young Guerrilla. Is that morale taking new members? Depends. What? Is there an age limit? I will plead for La Morale. If you take me. Welcome to the war, viejo. <laughs> So how do we take out the Admiral? Push-ups are the first step to victory. The Grand Hotel, Danny. That's the key. I got a convoy I like to make friends with. No. You need Carlito. Push-ups never lie. <laughs> you just cut your hand open. You sure doing push-ups was such a good idea? What can I say? Your little speech puffed me up. See, the part where you put the gun to your head and pull the trigger, that was crazy. Well, we have I three stories. Oh, wow. <laughs> Vanny needs to take care of. All right, let's see. The first love. To deliver my apology, you must be braver than I am. Um, rescue the missing member of. 67 ambush benito 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 yeah special convoy and this one is a loose the guardia named hugo is being interrogated by the grand hotel 
Hugo knows the location of La Morales HQ. Make sure. Okay. So I feel like this one's more important. We can probably do this one. Our little problem at the hotel. Well, why didn't you? I need you to go to the Grand Hotel Caballero. It used to be a resort for wealthy touristas, but Benitez converted it into some sort of prison torture hellhole. One of our fighters, Hugo, is being held there, which means he's got an appointment with the dentist, the regime's best interrogator. If the dentist gets any information out of him, we're fucked. He's got a good heart, but Hugo will crack like a fucking coconut. You need to stop that interrogation, whatever it takes. I already sent a scout to the hotel. She'll help when you get there. And one of Gilberto's people can get you past the guards if you hide in the back of his delivery truck. But you better hurry. The truck is leaving soon from the delivery yards. <coughs> yeah, this is very important. Out where we are, Danny. Yeah, if they figure out where we are, what we're, we're, we're screwed. Man gonna be for La Did you sleep during history class? El Tigre is the baddest motherfucker on this island. It's not 1967. Doesn't matter. El Tigre is a legend. I heard he kicked a plane out of the sky back then. You see his body at that age? It's all muscle. That was some speech, right? With El Tigre on our side, you got a fucking chance. Yup. Some people have mixed feelings though. Some people don't even know what to think of it. But everybody always talks, I guess. Walked in. You're doing this mission? Hell yeah. I hate dentists. Me too. They say when you're in her chair, you either give up information or your life. Or both. Rub into your eyes, my dude. To find Hugo quickly. Our scouts are already in position and ready to help. What does that sound like? Earlier. That was the voice <laughs> we needed. It Sometimes sounds like the uh, losing, surface, you know? uh, surf We're going to win this thing. What was the, the application called? Surf, surfway surf. I don't even know. Subway surfers. There we go. Kind of heard it for a second. I was like, wait a second. Nobody was allowed to look inside. Oh, for her. Fuck that. Go on. Head up. <laughs> she must be scary then in the video. <laughs> God damn. I wonder if she starts jumping on the Why you fucks? This item is huge, bro. Jesus. And the boy. Only used for emergencies. Danny, I'm your eyes on this one and I'm in position. The dentist is already in there with him. Yeah. I thought dentists were always late. Not this one. Oof. 
Well, that wasn't gonna work. Honestly, that whole stealth thing in this game wasn't gonna work for this part. A dentist! Holy shit! What's good, bro? Where did she go? Is she dead? That ass. Elena, the dentist is dead. La moral is safe. Now. That's fucking great news, honey. Oh, and I'm working on a gift for you. Gift? The hotel. I'm taking it. They have tortured their last guerrilla here. You sure you're not La Moral, Sammy? I'm just saying. Come on. Ah, oh, shit, shit. Excuse me. I was gonna revive him, but... Dude. Jesus. Where, where is he? Where is he? Wait, what? Oh. The man was hiding good. Jesus. So, uh, we, were, we were all looking for him. Come here. What do you want the people of Yara to know about the conflict? <laughs> conflict? It's business as usual. Look, in spite of all the rumors going around, there's no war. At least not here in Eastern Yara. Am I right, Admiral? This is not a war. Yeah. The criminals of La Libertad will be stopped. Yeah. They're few, we are many. You hear that? And... Libertards? This means chica. She means business. And what about the violent gang known as La Moral? Anyone who attacks Yara's military or business interests is not a true Yaran. My strategy... And I helped her with the strategy. I've got decades of experience. I ran a security firm. The East is safe. Am I right? Right. No prea coppas, por nada. That's a cut. I gotta go. Señor Presidente. Admiral, so lovely to hear your voice. If I could ask, how is it that a group of school children in El Este are inflicting the highest number of active duty casualties of this war? Admiral? They, um, they have support from Libertad and the Legends. I've always taken a personal interest in your career. Handpicked you out of the Academy. But make no mistake, there were more experienced, more qualified, and more intelligent officers in line before you. You stood out for one simple reason. Si, señor presidente. You were a woman in uniform. And now you could be the highest ranking woman ever to have her head on a pike. Gracias, señor presidente. Jesus, dude. You know, I thought that was a dude for a second. 
like no disrespect. I just thought it was a dude for a second. Just when I heard her voice, I was like, oh. And she's ruthless, just like just like Castillo, but they're all going down. They're all going down. Sooner or later. Wait, somebody had a birthday party in here. Alright, what mission is next? Let's see. Alright, so it's this one. This one's next. Can we go through here? Nope. Fast travel. Baby Tigre, let's talk. I like these young areas. They remind me of, well, me, only smaller. And it's going to take a lot more than a basement full of little me's to win this war. The time has come, baby Tigre. We need Carlito. The fifth legendary member of the 67th Revolution. And the toughest motherfucker I ever knew. Soldados would piss their pantalones when they came face to face with him. You know the expression, two birds with one stone? Well, Carlito once shot down two planes with one bullet. He is a national treasure. That was before he retired and went to work in the museum. The regime has put him in a cage to be insulted by filthy true Yaran turistas. His true destiny is on the field of battle. I'll meet you at the museum. Together we will free Carlito from his prison. Castillo has many bullets, but we will have Carlito, and Carlito only needs one. What I feel like it's gonna be like the complete opposite of what he's saying, but then in reality, like he's he's actually pretty badass. Like you would think he would the museum, look the part, but he doesn't. That guy knows everything, bro. I'm starting to think that he's he's a spy or some shit. Alright, so where's the museum at? Oh, okay. Not that far. We can't get a car. I don't think we can, at least. Um, actually, we can. We'll just have to take that road. Oh, damn, we have to go around that shit. Oof. <laughs> the car's fine, guys. Don't worry about the car, see? Y'all slow. Chickens, watch out! Chickens are immortal in this, immortal in this game. They, they never die. Like you, like you see them on the streets and you have no time to stop and you just go over them. They, you don't hear anything. But I assume that they're, that they live. Uh, 
we have time to take the fort. I need this. Shit. Damn. Where's where's the board? Shit, shit, shit. Who are you? How? I need the board. I need to destroy the board. Where's, where's the board? Oh, there it is. Yes, sir. Stars. Look at them, look at them. They still at it. Like if they're like if they're gonna do something. close El Tigre I'm at the museum Perfect parking <gasps> If you want to see photographs of us when we were young and dumb put your gun away and walk in like a tourista <laughs> I'm pretty sure we don't look anything like a tourist, but we'll try. Come on, I don't bite. Oh wow. You were the crazy one. When did I take my life? Come here. El Tigre, what are you doing? Are you not worried about getting recognized? Don't worry. I brought markers for autographs. One for me, one for you. That's not what I meant. This museum used to be dedicated to us legends. But Castillo rewrote history to make us look like villains. It's Castillo when he was young. found a way to paint Carlito in a bad light. I wonder what history will say about us. They will say... This was the day when two legends walked into a museum, and three walked out. <laughs> Always got something historical to say. Alright. You guerrillas are delusional if you think you can take down Castillo. Ah, shut up. Is that Diego? Poor kid never had a chance.
Can't even notice a thing. So we got the key to something. Um, it's probably. Oh, hell no. El Tigre! Is Carlito a fucking tank? Por supuesto. What were you expecting? He's Carlito. Oh my God. No way. No way, dude, it's a tank. Oh no! Where's he? Where's he? Where's he? Where's he? Boom. Come on. Oh, we about to blow shit up now. You gotta... What? <laughs> no way, bro. Dude, this thing has a flamethrower, bro. That's insane. I thought Carlito was gonna be like a guy or some shit. I told you, bro. It doesn't fit. It doesn't fit the looks. Oh, damn. What? Ah, uh, let's try this again. Really gonna Damn, that car's in the way. Really? How? There we go. Oh 
Oh shit. Yo, this thing is indestructible, Jesus. These characters are pretty good, bro. Far Cry did a good job of writing these characters. With the developers, Far Cry 6 has some good characters. You came! What the fuck is he doing here? I wanted him to see Carlito for himself. <laughs> Mi compay. How many years since you've been down this mountain? Too many. Carlito and I, we have a lot of good memories. Time to make some new ones. You should join us, hermano. War is over. When we are all free. <laughs> hey, come. Come on, it's gonna be good. I'm good. Come on. War is over when we are all free. Since when did you start quoting Lobo? When I finally saw past my own bullshit, and all that remained was the truth. <laughs> Lobo did have a way of cutting through bullshit. I wish he was here now. He'd be so happy to see us and Carlito. Happy to see you and Carlito, maybe. These are all like the ships that they have. Enough of that nonsense. The, I mean the planes. <laughs> He's like cleaning it. I love these characters, man. All right, guys. So this is gonna wrap up this video. War is over um. when we are all free. This way, did you start quoting Lobo? When I finally saw past my own. But yeah, hopefully you guys are enjoying Far Cry 6 so far. Um, I'm going to be finishing up the whole game so you don't have to worry about it. Uh, you don't have to worry about me like not finishing the game at all. But yeah, man. Everything is good. Can I get up here? Up, up. I can't get up. Come on. There we go. Jesus. You got stuck there for a second. Wait. What's... Oh. Oh, I thought it was going to be like a special like area. All right. Well, that was a waste of time. All right, guys. Thank you for watching and um, I'll see you in the next one.